I think I figured that out. <clears throat> it says I'm live. Yeah, the uh, video encoding is having troubles for a minute. Uh, whoops. Sorry, I've been testing things. Okay, that should hopefully have fixed it. Um, if it happens again, I mean, it's just gonna drop the frame rate, so it's gonna be kinda dodgy. Hopefully, it doesn't affect the audio, because as long as the audio's okay. You can kind of ignore bad video, but if the audio is not good, it's, it's useless. So, okay, let's get into this. Banjo-Kazooie. All right, we're starting with, uh, rather continuing with Bubble Gloop Swamp from Cook Cookin' Banjo. Um... Oh, you know what? When I was playing last time, I might have been playing on the wrong account, uh, which means that... <laughs> Whoops. Okay, I'm, uh... I'm gonna switch accounts. It's not the bit because there's three of them on each one. Hold on. Hold on a second. Uh... Let's go back to home. And then we will... Switch profile to Donani. <sighs> Might have this up. Hold on. Hold on a sec. <clears throat> I am not game, so... Um, more options? Let's quit. And yeah, let's uh, switch to the other profile. Start it back up. This might fix it, uh, hopefully, because it's gonna be a pain if I have to <laughs> if I have to start the game over again when I was already three three worlds in. We'll find out. I mean, it's not I can do them again. It's just it took me a couple hours last time, so it would suck to lose that progress. Okay, here we go. Yeah. I'm just I'm stupid. I accidentally played it on the wrong profile. So this is Coco's profile, but I didn't overwrite Coco's game, so it's not like it matters that much. I'm just gonna have to keep doing this. Though if I might be able to finish this um today. I'm not positive. But I could. I know this game well enough that I could, uh, I, I, I'm gonna 100% it. I just, you know, it's gonna take some time. Especially with Click Clock Woods, because I always, always just fall and tumble around on that one. And it just is a pain. So, we'll see when we get there. Might be, might be a third stream for this one. But for now, just gonna do this. Uh, Bubble Loop Swamp, I believe, is this way? Let's go, go, go. Yeah, that looks very Bubble Loop Swamp-esque. Turn around. Turn around. Whoa, what? Got him. I got him. No worries, guys. Well, I'm a pro gamer here, so. Ain't no thing. Ooh, see that? Speedrun's threat is faster. <sighs> All right, Bubble Loop Swamp. Uh, I don't care for this one because I always get, <laughs> I always have a bit of trouble finding everything because of the way it's designed. But let's let's do this. Now we learned the boots, which we need for the swamp. Technically, you can just run through. It's not like. Um, in the, the next game, it just kicks you out if you go into the place you can't. In this one, you can, you can make it through, you'll just take damage as you go. So, with that in mind, let's make sure we don't miss anything in these little nooks and crannies. 
That's I, with the shading and stuff, it can be kind of difficult to tell what's what. Yeah. Eat, eat, my boy. Hungry boy. All right. Ah, uh, nuts. Sorry. Trying not to, like, belch directly in the mic, because that's disgusting, but, uh... It's also a bit distracting. So... Let's see. Uh, oh, yeah. Don't think I don't see you there. Yeah, see what I mean? You can, like, you can still make it out with only taking a single damage. It's hard. But I'm really good at this game, so you know, it's not that hard. Who's that? Ah. Ah. Get, get him! Get him! Get, get him! Okay. Oh, get, yeah, there we go. Oh, I didn't even take damage from the piranhas the first time. Huh. Oh, whoop. Nope. Okay, definitely took damage that time. Up we go. Egg. Do I need him? Not really. But I won't. So I'm gonna take him. Uh, starting out with a healthy zero viewers. Listen, I'm not very good at marketing my stream and marketing in general. I, just, I don't like doing it. Like, as an actor, um, marketing is like a big part of doing it professionally. Like, you can be an actor and not market yourself. And just have fun with it. But if you want to do it as a job, which I do do it as a job, uh, it's uh, yeah, it's a lot of marketing, and I'm, I'm not a huge fan of doing that. Marketing just feels scummy, no matter no matter how you do it. So I I, I don't do it for the most part. Let's get this guy. Nice. Bam. And we blam. And then we up top again. Oh, blam. And then, uh, uh, that one. Blah. And one last little. It, whip, 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 up, up, on the. Thank it. It's a little pointy. Bam. Nice. Yeah. I, uh, cleaned up my room since last time, so if you watch this video versus the last video. My big dresser full of books is over here now, off camera, um, and now I have uh, my keyboard, my, my musical keyboard, with like a blanket and a bunch of plush toys behind me. Whoop, come on, get out of there. Um, so... Let me know, let me know how you feel about that as a factor. I also have the cool Rose Quartz Flag, which I think I got because I pre-ordered the Steven Universe soundtrack on vinyl. It's the first two seasons in soundtrack, which, it'd be cool to have the complete soundtrack, but it just, it looks super cool. It's, um, it's like got the gems on it. I don't have a record player. I, ha I have quite a few records, which I mostly do to support, um, Support artists I like, but I, d I don't actually own a record player yet. Which, most people in my family do own record players because we're all dirty, dirty hipsters. Um, but... Yeah, I... need to get one at some point so I can actually listen to all this music I bought. But in the meantime, I got the cool flag, which was a little bonus. But they did because they had to, uh... They did it as a little extra because they... Um... Sorry, I'm a little focused here. Get Get him! 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 Whoop! Whoa! Hit. Okay. Come, on. Come back. Come back. Come back here. Come back here. Golden. Bugger. Okay. Um. But yeah, it was a 
because... Actually, I don't think it was a pre or bonus, which I might have said before. It was... There was a misprint where they accidentally put, uh, I think, Garnet's colors on Amethyst's... Um... Gem. So they had to reprint them. And in the meantime, they sent that. There's also... I got, like, a nice... A nice custom drawing saying thank you for purchasing it. Uh, that is... If not drawn by Rebecca Sugar, at the very least signed by Rebecca Sugar, so that's really cool. I appreciate it. I believe I got that from Fangamer. Um, that's, that's good. Uh, this is not really a gaming thing, but Fangamer has some cool stuff. And in fact, this isn't like sponsor or anything, it's just a coincidence. They're actually doing a bunch of Banjo Kazooie stuff right now. So if you are a longtime fan of Banjo Kazooie, or if you uh, you're getting into it because of my stream. <laughs> It's unlikely, but if if you like Banjo Kazooie, they got some cool Banjo Kazooie stuff. They got like this little pin that's like Banjo's backpack, and you flip up the top, and it's like a uh, it's uh, a Kazooie's in there. Just hanging out. Because she lives in your backpack in the game. That's pretty fun. I think I got it. Yeah, it's hard to tell because I usually go off of the sound in this part, but the sound is a little delayed. Um, my audio issues are a whole other thing. I've gone into them in other streams. I'm gonna figure out a way around it at some point, but for the time being, I don't really care that much. It throws me off a tiny bit, not enough to really matter. Uh, ooh, do I want to do this? Yeah, let's get this out of the way. Alright, this is timed. I can take it slow. Yes! That is experience, friends. That is... That's how you do that one. Although, I've seen speedrunners do this part, and they literally just, like, jump to the middle of the bridge, jump to the end. And the amount of, like, practice that would have to go into doing just that trick is mind-boggling. Well, they did it. Um, don't you do it. Don't you dare. Ah. Nope. You got him. Um, let me see if... See secrets back here? I think there was something. I, I heard it. But, uh, did not see it, because it's secret. Right, I'm just gonna steal Mumbo's stuff, because you can- he always has one of these posts, and he has a bunch of stuff up here. Aha! There's the empty honeycomb for this area. Nice. So let me just- whoop! Nope, nope. Let me do that again. I know I can get it, I just... Oh, nope, nope. Come on, come on. Banjo. Banjo! Kazooie! Ah, I got it. Nice. I believe there's at least two of those... Oh, two of those. The other way... The, the backwards peace sign. I know this is a... Okay. There's... Uh, modern peace. The actual 60s piece, which is, you know, chill. I learned that from an old hippie. Uh, there's V for victory, which is what they call it in Japan. And then if you do it backwards, it's a very rude thing in, uh, in Britain. So I'm gonna be careful not to do that, even though more it feels more natural to me. Um... So apologies to any British viewers that might have been offended by my uh, my rude hand gesture. It was not my intention. Although I will also apologize for uh, just butchering your accents. I, it sounds anytime I do a British accent, it pretty quickly devolves into Western Australian. Maybe maybe Eastern Australian. Yeah, it's generally... It's generally not very well done. Um, son of a... No. That was a... That was a trade-off. Um, oh, actually, this is... Yeah, this is the spot I can in on. Which I gotta be... I gotta be that there. 
gator guy to do, so I'm gonna gonna hold off on that and come back around to it. Whoop. There we go. Anything over there? Eggs. Don't need eggs. I don't need the eggs. They're not important. Ooh, ooh, and I need a definitely need some health, so oh, wow. This poor guy, his feet. His poor feet. In. <laughs> his scream is a little too much, I'd say. Especially because this is like a kid's game, so it's like... You have it, it like, sounds like it hurts. Like, it really sounds like you, like, got him bad. But, in the end, you're helping him, apparently, so it works out. So the, he liked it, I guess. You had to force him to put his feet away. Like an idiot. I don't know. If he likes it, I guess it's, it's, it's ends just by the means or whatever, but that's... Ooh, that's something. I mean, make sure. I don't think that's enough of an inclined matter, but just to be safe... Ginger. I wonder if I did that on time. Because I get, I, it's a little off. I want to stop X. X is not going to work. Can I go with him? I can! Right! I remember this part. This is... First off, this is some musical notes. Because this is the Tip Top Choir. I love the tipped up choir. It's, I mean, I love it aesthetically. It is just a uh, red, purple, red. Uh, it is just a memory game, but but that's fine. You don't necessarily need something more than a memory game in a game like this. Red, purple. Red. Wow. All right, what's next? What's next, Tip Top? So blue, uh, other blue, blue, red. Or I guess this is like a violet? This is very close to the other blue on my screen. Blue, blue. Red, light blue. I guess it's three blues, or that's like a purple blue? I don't know. All right, last one. All right, middle, purple. Middle, other. Yellow, purple, yellow. Okay, so that's middle, pur purple. Middle, other. Yellow. Uh, purple. Yellow? Yellow was the last one? Okay. I did it. <laughs> I, I can do... I don't have the best memory. Um... For stuff like that, but I can I can do up to about seven to eight. Um, before I forget. Welcome. Got a. I've got half of the jiggies already, and I've only been in here what? Nineteen minutes. <coughs> doing it, doing it, doing it well. Whoop whoop. Nope. All right. So let's go over to this branch of the swamp. Anything over there? Red feathers. You gotta, in this one, you gotta constantly, like, hop around between all the things. Uh, I think, okay, that is a shock jump. Whoop, and then, yeah! And then most of this stuff in this corner I'm gonna get when I'm the gator. Right, and that's, ah, that's how her hat, Okay, let's help her hat do that, and then we're gonna go back out and uh, do that later. 
In the meantime, one more smashing. This one? Yes, okay. Woo, you don't really get a second shot on that one. Uh, okay. Can we go? Oh, I missed it. Okay, let me try that again. All right, let's try it from back here. Hold on, over here. Oh, 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 nope, nope, nope. Missed it. <sighs> this one's tricky. Okay. Maybe from the pad itself. You can book them. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, I guess I gotta stop myself early on that. So let's go this, and then... Oh, oh, oh. Hold on, I, I don't even think I need it right now, but... I'd rather get it now before I forget it's here. Oh, there we go. All right. Up we go. That's going to be off sync. Why do I keep trying to sing along? I am the fool. Um, let me go along this lower path, though. I think there's a secret somewhere along here. All these underneath ones I'm gonna do, uh, as the gator in a minute. Gator? Oh. Oh, or... I'll just get the... Buff, buff Banjo. Buff Joe. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I can't get back up. Oh, no. Oh, no. Jump up, jump up! Ah! Oh, hit. That's fine. I'll come back. I'll come back in a minute. I got the main thing from there. Alright, now we're gonna go uphill. Get some of these guys. Um, come back to that. Ooh, okay. Come back for the switch in a minute. Oh, thank you for your delicious nectars. Your uh, sacrifice is not in vain. Feed the boy. Feed the boy. Oh, now he's up there? But I just can't... Okay. I'll go back there after I do this... Um, this jiggy. Well, since I fell down, I may as well just go. Go get this guy. This way. Nope, 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 nope. Ooh. My main thing. I don't care about taking damage as much because, you know, I'm a pro gamer and we don't take damage. Uh, but, um, but, uh, but, uh, if you fall, that's wasted time, and time is a real world resource. I don't mind video game, losing video game resources, but losing real world resources like time, that's upsetting. Um, I don't actually know where he showed up. Uh, is that it? I don't know. I'll go searching for him later. For the time being, let's do it. Okay, that's not that far. Now we go. Do, 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 do. Whoa. Whoa. Just gotta keep moving. Don't stop. Don't stop the rock! <laughs> yes! That's how you do it. That's how you do it. With skills! Probably couldn't hear me there. <laughs> uh, this mic is designed specifically to block out noise from the side, so if I go to the side of it, I can't really hear it as well as if I'm actually over in front of it. So, gotta be careful not to do that. Oh, oh, oh. 
Oh, my soul left my body for a second. Jeez. I gotta hydrate off that one. Oh, man. You talking Five Nights at Freddy's, you talking Amnesia. Ah, Andrew Kazooie. This is a real horror game right here. Um, okay, so I got that, I got that. I believe that's pretty much everything, um... Without being the crocodile. So let's go be the crocodile slash alligator. He'll say which one. When I was a kid, I used to know the difference. Um, rather, I do still know the difference, I just don't know the uh, which is which. One of them has teeth that will hang uh, up and down. One just down. The other one just down. And then... Um, some of them, the they have a flatter, uh, a flatter, wider head than the others. I don't remember which is which, but I do remember that that's how you can tell them apart. So, take that lack of information with you. I guess, I guess, I guess that wasn't very helpful. Uh, there we go. And I noticed that my uh, sound capture for the Elgato died out, so apologies on that. Um, if uh, past past experience is to be believed, it should come back on its own momentarily. Ah, there we go. There was a secret back there. Yep, there it is. I don't know why it does that. Oh. It'll be choppy for a minute, but it's gonna work. So, uh, yeah, I don't know why it does that. Apologies. Um, it it'll just come in and out as it pleases, I guess. Yes. <laughs> this is my favorite from this game. Look at him. Look at him. He's so cute. Little thick boy. Squaddling around. <laughs> oh, that's where... That's where you end... Oh, and there's a whole section back here. What the heck? Okay, I'll come back to that later. Um, uh, yeah, I, I personally have a huge affinity for, like, lizards and reptiles. I just think they look real cute. Um, we were actually watching a... Uh, we were watching a Netflix, like reality show too hot to handle it's real dumb i would not suggest watching it we watched like two episodes and we were like we're good we don't need any more of this but uh yeah there was there was uh it, it, it it's whatever it's like oh look at these like swingers wow they 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 screw around a lot. How about we force them to be abstinent for like a week or whatever? And if they do, they earn money. And it's, it was dumb. All the characters. It was very scripted, like a lot of bad reality shows. Um, but uh, yeah, that, that whatever. Uh, the thing I liked was that there was a lot of awesome like iguana footage because it's on a tropical island. So every now and then they just cut to some iguanas hanging out or running across the beach. That's what I'm here for. I, I joked about, um, I joked about, uh, I joked about, hold on, let me see if I can fix this by doing that. Ooh, why is it not giving me an output? Apologies, I don't know why it's, why the sound is not working. Very strange. Uh, maybe if I... This is desktop audio, so that's not gonna help me. Huh. Let me make sure it's not something with the Xbox. Sorry about this, folks. Technical difficulties. Volume and audio output. That would be it. 
Uh, yeah, that should be it. Uh-huh. Oh, optical audio. I'll have to remember that. Uh, I'm not using that. Gosh, yeah, I don't know why the game audio has just crapped itself. My my apologies, guys. Um, uh, hopefully I'll figure that out later, but for now, you're just going to have to listen to my my beautiful voice. As we go about to sing. Um, anything I want to grab in here before we start? Oh, wait a minute. Ah, crud. Well, no, I can do this without the, the runny shoes. Yep, yep, yep. Greedious croc. Let's do it. Okay, I just gotta eat the red ones. Get him. Get him. Get him. If I remember, he has like a rubber banding mechanic that makes it a little difficult later on. But this guy is pretty easy in the first few rounds. Just gotta kind of mash X. To hop, 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 hop. Do a little, do a little munching. And we go. And we go. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out this audio. I'm gonna probably finish, um, finish out this bit, and then I will take a break to figure out what the audio, uh, what's going on with the audio. Oh, geez. Actually, this is much closer than I thought it was. Oh no. Oh, jeez, I gotta get a couple more. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, this is way, way closer than I thought it'd be. Uh, uh. Uh, we tied? Does that count? Okay, I lost. Oh, oh. Oh. Well, audio came back on its own again. No! Don't leave me alone. Okay. Okay, let's go. Just gotta kind of look out. There is like a rubber, rubber banding mechanic. Yep. Gotta get him. Gotta get the most. I'm hungry. I'm hungry, crocodile. Going. No, no, no. Mine. <laughs> Nope, 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 they're mine. They're mine. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. My foods. No, no. The growing crocodile needs foods. Back off. My foods. My foods. Oh, oh, oh. There he is. Oh. Oh. The growing boy. I need my young foods. Okay, not nearly as close this time, because I was focusing on harder. There we go. I believe you have to do it twice? Three times, there might be three games. Okay, yeah, there's this one, and then there's the one where it switches. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, oh, don't eat the yellow. Only eat the red ones. The yellow ones ain't right. No, no, no. Crap, 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 crap. There, there. Whoa. Yes. Yes. Give me the guys. Give me the guys. Give me the guys. Give me the guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I need some. I need some. Give me just one. Give me just a couple. I need just one dollar. I just need two, three dollars. Give me three week. No, no. Okay, okay. Oh, 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 oh. Mine. Mine, mine, mine. No, 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 no. It's mine. It's mine. That one's mine too. Don't do it. No, don't do it. No, no. That one's mine. No, no. Oh boy. That one was really close. All right. Now this is the really tricky one because you got to keep up with it, but it switches every 10 seconds. So I just got to watch for the 
into grow ten, and then switch over. Oh, no. oh, I ate one at the wrong time. Okay. Crap, crap, crap. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, I've already lost this one. Yeah, I've definitely lost this one already. Uh, 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 red. One more, and then I'm gonna get ready for the yellow. Okay, and then reds. Nope, nope. Oh man, I missed. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Nope, 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 nope. Mine, mine. <laughs> Got it. Got it. Oh, there's so many. Oh, there's so many. Get, get. Okay, I got that. I got that. I got it. I got it. Yes. <laughs> oh, that one's like really hard. Even like even now. As a kid, I had a few problems, but now it's like, whew. <laughs> oh, um. Excuse me, I probably just, according to the OBS, I just blew the audio for a second. Listen. What do you say? Uh, I don't need to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're so scary. Oh, you're so scary. <laughs> I ain't scared. I'm not scared. I'm just, I'm just trying to play a game. Trying to play a game. <sighs> Alright, uh, this area looks like it's not much of anything for me right now, so I'm gonna go to the other area. I think was to the left out of here. It's uh it, it's all just kind of pockets, you know? Um little 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 regions for you to slide into. That's the, yes, this side. This side has a bunch of the stuff. And then we're gonna go back as uh, Bear and Bert to uh, do the other ones. So right now I think the last one I need to do is the Jinjos. And the, uh, sh it's gonna be, uh, the, uh, the, 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 the gold boys. The golden boys. Let's see, anything else good? Oh, that's pretty much everything. Got the mitts. Got the, um, whoop. Yeah, no, you don't. Oh, gonna get the ginger. Right, now, blue ginger was in that last spot. I think that's everything for the crocodile. So as cute as he is, gotta go. Goodbye, little friend. You'll be missed. Whoa! I like when you jump off at a slight angle, because then you like kind of. He he always jumps parallel to whatever angle he was on when he started. Okay. Nearly 40 minutes through, and I've nearly 100% this one. I think, I think what I'm gonna do is do another three levels here, and then save uh, Rusty Bucket Bay. Yeah, yeah, that works out. Cause then it's um, it's three more worlds. Uh, there, okay, so there are five more worlds, including this one, and then the uh, the final confrontation, which is like a whole thing unto itself. So it's basically nine. So I did three last time, I'll do three this time, and then I will finish off with uh, the the last two and the, the final area. That should work out, I think. Not certain. In the meantime, though, I am going to... Uh, I'm going to actually take a biology break, so I'll be right back with you.
Okay, back at it. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna do this. Gobi's Desert and uh, Freeze Easy Peeps. Yes, those are the, those are all of them. I might, depending on how long that takes me, I might uh, unlock Rusty Bucket Bay in this one, but might save it till next time. Not sure yet. Whoa! Ah, oh, crud. Oh, God. Oh, no. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Oh, that was close. Buddy. My goodness. I really need to get some health. Oh, jeez. Um, okay, and that one is behind the... Yep. That's one of the things, as you notice going through this level, it's like, man, there's a lot of, like, empty spaces. That's why. That's why they empty. Make space for that man. There we go. Got all hundred. And then we got... I do not want to fall in the water. And we got the ginger. Right? And I want to be careful coming down because there was that frog. I do not want him to hit me. Because I only got one damage. Okay. Don't fall in. Yes. Okay. That should do it for that. And then I think I got to do the frogs last. Uh, what are my totals here? There's still an empty honeycomb around here. Where's that? Ooh, I checked all the places, haven't I? See, I got one in Mumbo. Is there like a sneaky another one? Oh, would it be on top of the maze? <laughs> oh jeez. Oh gosh. Oh, I gotta, I gotta be more careful. Oh, maybe it's on top of this guy? Did not try hanging out on top. Uh, for this fella. Did I? Actually, I might have gone up top here. Uh, okay, that's boots. I do not need the boots. I need... I need the last hunting cone. Um, before I do that, I'm going to run back to the entrance because there is a uh, beehive. Ooh, fall. Oh, where is the last empty honeycomb at? Part of me wants to say, let's come back, but on the other hand, I'd rather just get it done now. I look it up. That feels really sad. I'd rather not. Oh, actually, what am I doing? I can talk to. Yep, waiting boots. That's how you boots. Oh, okay, he doesn't heal you if you didn't learn it. Shoot. That doesn't help me very much. Now for that lovely gaming sin of backtracking out of desperation. And let me remind you, this is the first level of the game. <sighs> Classic JonTron was uh, better you know, before he became a became a heckin' heckin' jerk. Can't can't handle JonTron really anymore. It's you know some of his stuff can be entertaining, but like, man, he's just such a gross dude. It's, it's really hard to justify watching him for any reason. <sighs> sad, sad, you know? Be, if, I wish we didn't have to be in a situation where everybody's, everybody's stuff is right out in the open and they're, they're making it clear they don't care. They just, they, they just gonna do the same gross stuff they were gonna do, regardless. Oh well, that's, that's, that's their choice. That's their choice as Americans. 
get the freedom to do it. And the freedom to get, you know, get, uh, lambasted for it. I don't want to say cancel, because it's such, it's such a misnomer. Because, like, we can say that all we want, but if you look at everybody who's been cancelled, nothing's happened. They're, they're, they still have careers, they're still doing pretty much fine. And it's like, what's even the power of cancelling if that's, that's all that comes from it? Is they're just kind of upset for a little while, they have to make a bad apology, and they have to move on with their life, and they remain successful. Like, the only ones who don't continue to be successful are the ones who go to jail, and so they were being cancelled for, like, reasons that are very overtly illegal. So I just, yeah, I don't, I don't really know. I don't really know what's going on with that. It's also, it's hard to, like... It's hard to even approve of the idea of canceling because it's so vicious. It, it's it's like so vicious, and it's like it goes completely against the idea of like a fair trial and everything. Like obviously social social stuff. It's so easy for there to just be an angry mob of people. An angry mob of people against someone out of nowhere because information spreads so much faster. And whether they deserve it or not, that I mean that's a case by case basis. Some people very clearly deserve it, and other people go back and forth. Um Where is this last empty? The empty honeycombs are really where this game kind of drags. It's like it's just a lot of fiddliness, and they're never in. They're like the ones that are really hard to find, and rightfully so. You know, you gotta have some collectibles that are hard to hard to track down in a collectathon game. But man, it's just there, there's not always a logic to where they're at. It'd be good to have at least that, so that you don't have to, you know, keep going around and back and forth and this and that. And, hmm, could it be in the turtle? I don't think so. I think I got everything from the turtle. But, uh, let's go, in. Let's go back in here. Anything? Anything? They're gone! No! Vacate the premises. I say it. But then we find out in Banjo Tui that Tip Top went off and became a mom. And it's okay. That's all happy times for Tip Top. And I don't like how Kazooie's glaring at me over there. <laughs> I didn't do anything wrong. Stop. Please don't. Gosh, yeah, I might have to leave and come back at another time for this one because I cannot, for the life of me, know where this empty honeycomb is. It doesn't end this guy. Maybe it has. Maybe it's something. Something in here? Wait, can I get on top? Is it like on top somewhere? I can see everything on top. Maybe as the gator. You know, yeah, I think there's like a secret section of the maze that you can only really get to as the gator. Or something like that. I might be thinking of a pumpkin in a uh, da 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 haunty, make scary stuff. 
scary times. Oh, you know what? There are nine levels, thinking about it, because I forgot about that one. Well, that one will be in the last one here, I think. Haunted Mansion Cave. What's it called? Hold on. Rumble's Mountain. Uh, Treasure Trove Cove. Clanker's Cavern. Bubble Loop Swamp. Gobi's Desert. Uh, 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 another one. Another, another one. Treasure Trove Cove. Freeze Easy, er, Hailfire Peak? Freeze Easy Peaks. Hailfire is the, uh, sequel. Um, okay. Mad Monster Mansion. That's what that one's called. Mad Monster Mansion. Okay, so I think... Yeah, I think that's the one before Rusty Bucket Bay. Maybe that's Mad Monster Mansion. Hmm. Ah, that's where it is, right? Right? No, that's back into the maze? What is that? Hold on, there's gotta be like a secret entrance or something, right? And th there has to be another thing with this guy. That has to be it, right? I don't know, man. Anything over here? Secrets? Secrets? Just don't know where this last honeycomb is. Uh, I really don't want to have to come back later. But I might have to. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, I know it's around here somewhere. Come on. Don't make me look like a fool in front of one viewer. Thanks for tuning in. I, yeah, I had zero viewers for most of the stream, which, like I said at the time, I don't mark it very well, so that's my bad, but thanks for showing up. I'm, I'm trying to find the last empty honeycomb. I got the one in Mumbo's hut, and I'm trying to find the last one here before I leave, but I think, I think I might be out of luck. I think I might have to backtrack. Uh, I don't wanna. All right, let's, let's check back into here. There's gotta be like a sneaky secret somewhere, right? I'm gonna find this. Hmm. Where do I go? That's my problem with this level, is just like, it's so... Ooh, it's, it's just tricky to like, navigate some parts of it because it just blends together. If I had an overhead map, that would be ideal, but I don't. You can find them. I think they were in the original uh, instruction manual that you could find them, but I don't have that. Because I am playing on the Xbox version. Oh man, I've spent like 10 minutes looking for just this one. Oh. Maybe, oh, maybe it's under, maybe it's under this arch? Is it over here? Sneaky? No. Where is it? I remember, I feel like I've done this every time I've played this level to get the 100%. I just can never find the second one and I always forget where it's at. Guy, I can see it. 
There's no secrets. There are no secrets for me. Hmm. Geese outside. And realize geese would be hanging out at this time of time of year. Where is it? Where do I go to get the last Hanticam? It is going to give me a little extra bit of health once I find all six of them. Over here, right? Right! Yeah, like it'd have to be like... It'd have to be there or like in one of these tiny nooks and crannies. level with the fine tooth comb, but like... Is that what I'm gonna have to do? That's pretty much what I'm doing already. Just some of this last honeycomb piece. And the worst part is, if it's not on the ground, it's gonna be like tucked up on top of something or like under a thing. That's no good. Come on, man. Um, I definitely checked over in this corner, but I guess I'll double check over here. There might be a little secret passage or something. Secret passage only for Gator. Only the Gator can go through the passage. Hmm? Oh. Come on. Come on! Where's it at? Quit fooling. Yeah. This this part of the game, this this can get kind of exhausting. I'm kinda just tired anyways. I've been staying up late a lot lately since the weekend. We're having fun. But not the best idea. One of us works. Okay, I should rephrase. One of us works full time. The other two of us who live here, they we work, but we work um we work uh freelance, so it's not a uh, not as intensive in terms of hours. I'll just... I guess I'll just go around here. I just... I, let me double check. I really didn't get it. No, I'm just missing that one honeycomb. What am I to do here? Is it like tucked into here? Scoop that out. That's not it. What is going on? I just have no idea. I've checked everywhere. <laughs> I've checked every corner of this, of this level. Where is it? Hmm? 
It's gonna be on top of like one of these poles or something, isn't it? All right. Okay, I'm calling in a lifeline. I'm looking up a walkthrough. I got everything else. I just, for the sake of the stream, I'm gonna look up where to find this. So bubble, swamp, honey, bubble gloop swamp honeycomb. Wow, it's like the first thing. All right, that one says. This, that's not. Oh yeah. Okay. New moves. Jiggies. All right, I got all the jiggies. Honeycomb. Okay, that one's a mumbo. Oh. You have to like backflip in the in the turtle. You have to do a backflip off the podium, so it's one of those ones that's just not visible. Great! Glad that happens. So I gotta go all the way back to Mumbo. All the way over to the turtle. Oh, great. I mean, it could be worse. I mean, it's, there's a lot of worse things I could be doing right now than playing, playing Banjo-Kazooie. Is this this is like this is like my ideal just chillin playing banjo kazooie i could play this game i could play this game forever dude i mean at a certain point you 100 but i'd start right over that's just how fun it is all right change me back change me back do not lunch change back okay Go to tip top. Oh jeez, I gotta, gotta do the boots. Can't play around here. I gotta. I want to do this, and I don't want to die because I only got the one health left. So I can't. I can't play around. Okay, let's uh. Oh, jeez, maybe I shouldn't be doing this. Maybe this is a bad idea. Maybe this is a really bad idea. Okay. I can get to the pole. Oh, oh, come on, grab it. Oh, thank you. I think these are supposed to be cat's tails? These poles? Because they got, like, the big old, big old squishy thing on the top. I presume squishy. It looks squishy. Maybe it's not squishy. I don't know. Alright. Just gotta get to the turtle without dying. Then I can just jump in the swamp and get sent back to the beginning of the level. Alright. We're in. Go over. Podium. Yeah, okay. How was I supposed to see that? I got it. So now we just gotta throw ourselves in the drink. Get sent back to the beginning of the level. Speedrun strat. Speedrun strat. Alright, happy time. Alright, took me an hour because I had to do an extra like 20 minutes finding that honeycomb. I feel foolish, but I did it. It's done. Uh, wait, where are the... Oh, I know there's a pet pair of boots around here somewhere. Come on now, don't play with me. I know I got a pair of boots. And I can get... I know I can get a pair of boots. Let me at them boots. Nope, not you. Not yet. We'll come back to you later. Right now, I just need them boots. There they are. Let's go. Can I go, 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 go right now. Nope. 
Nope, nope. Should not sing along. Not when I have leg on the audio. Oh, this is the freeze easy peak. Okay. Then it is good that I got here. I do want to do this. Oh, maybe freeze easy peak is next? I mean, I guess I could do freeze easy peak now. I got these all out of order then, so it's Mumbles Mountain, Mumbles Mountain, Treasure Trove Cove, Clanker's Cavern, Bubble Poop Swamp, Freeze Easy Peak, Gobi's Desert, um, Gobi Desert, oh, that's what you gotta be the gator for, okay. Uh, Freeze Easy Peak. Mad Monster Mansion, uh, Freeze Easy Peak, Gobi Desert, Mad Monster Mansion, Rusty Bucket Bay, Click Clack Woods, and then, uh, Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. That might be the second one. Oh man, it's so dark on my screen. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Gotta get up on the way out. Gotta get up there. Okay. Okay, now I gotta become the gator. Do whatever that secret is. This should only take a couple minutes, though. In fact, let's just speed it up. And this way. They can munch all they want, dude. I don't give a two. I don't give a heckin' dang. Gone. Whoop. Up. Oh, thing. Might as well. Alright. Now we go. It's just like the tiniest bit faster, I'm pretty sure. But you can use the like if you jump at the right angle, you can you can like redirect your jump to like curve around walls. So it's like yeah, it can be better for that. Optimize your pads or whatever. I don't know. I don't speed run. I just 100% banjo kazooie. That's pretty much the only skill I really have as a gamer. 100% banjo kazooie. Cause I know pretty much everything. You know that I had to look something up earlier. It's not a not a useful thing to know. You don't need to know that. All you need to know is. This guy's heckin' steppin'. No feet's going. Whoops. Oh, I jumped the gun on that one. Glad that the tiniest tip of his eyes sticks over the water. Also, I don't know why they're implying that a piranha would not bite a crocodile, but they would bite a bear and bird. I don't know, man. Maybe the crocodile's just too tough. It's like, like leather. Try and chew on a piece of that for a minute. I'm gonna be happy. Here we go. Alright, go through the tube. Gotta go through the tube. Well, I'm the real small guy. Easier to get through. Close up. Over here. There we go. Gosh, I just. Mm, the theming! Both, like, musically and just game wise. The way it just, like, shifts over the music like that. Oh. Oh, it's so nice. It's 
so nice, dude. This this game is it's just so polished, which is really why it was so disappointing in a. It was so disappointing in the the sequel, or not even the sequel in the the spiritual successor ukulele that like there's just so little polish like more than anything banjo kazooie's controls and camera are so solid and they just totally messed that up in this that's just it's just frustrating it's just the polish is so solid there are like maybe two spots that seem like glitches, but the fact that in an any percent run, there's basically no glitches being used. It's just, oh, it's beautiful. I actually think, no, Kobe's Desert has to be next. Cause you don't even get to the, the area with three ZZ Peaks until like way later, right? I don't remember. We'll find out, I guess. Oh, I know every like, inch of this game. I guess I don't. Yep. Whoa! Whoa! I'm changing! Oh, just get him, get him, get him. Oh, that's baloney. Really? That's... that's... so dumb. Whatever. Uh... Let's see. Oh, little trick here. Nope, nope. That is incorrect. Nope, not that one. This one? Nope. Is it A? Yeah. You do this, you can hit this fish. Take him out! Not that that's, like, crazy helpful or anything. It's just a fun little Easter egg for anybody who didn't realize that that giant piranha can be killed. Get him. Get him. Get him. Got him. Nope. I keep trying to sing along. Because A, it's very catchy music, and B, that's a good way to uh, fill up time. But, uh. Unfortunately. It's. It's. Like, no, so I can't do that. Otherwise, I will drive all of the viewers out of their minds. Because it's gonna be just slight, slight delay. Alright, we popping up. And we're gonna go back. I think I hear Gobi Desert now. I don't know. Did I open Gobi's Desert yet? Might not have. Let's look. That was would have been the last time. Nope. It's not open yet. Well. Guess I'll be back here. That's another thing I really love about this, is how everything just weaves together so well. Where, like, I I did, um, I opened one world, but I can't go there yet, so I'm just gonna keep going to this next world. Oh, gotta hit him two times. Hit me one time, do do. Hit me two time, do do do. And let's wake up the ding pot. I think that's... Yeah, yeah, that's the beginning of the game, so this that's a good way to hop all the way back here. And we do a little... Nope, 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 incorrect. We do a little, uh, this one. Egg. Which does not really help us yet, but uh, we'll keep that in mind for later. Um, whoop, 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 350, 350, I can pop that. I can pop that one. Nice. Nice. 
let's hop on through. How long have we been going? Hour 17? Okay, in, uh... Just a bit, I'm gonna stop and, uh... Archive this recording. I'm gonna have a couple of tiny ones on top of that. Bam! Okay, now we got Gobi's Valley. Gobi's Valley, it kept saying Gobi's Desert. So I guess you could do them in either. I think based on that uh, order, you're supposed to go to Freeze Easy Peaks first, but I'm gonna go to Freeze Easy Peaks later. Oh no, oh no. Oh, it's dark. Uh, I can't, I can't see. I can't, I can't see. Um, and then over there, I'd want to go as a plumpkin because it's a little tiny spot. This is where Mad Monster Mansion will be. I, I mean, Mad Monster Mansion is one of the best stages. There's no denying that. I think Krusty Bucket Bay might be my favorite one, to be honest. It's like, it's a pain, but I just love the, like, industrial look of it. I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's, I enjoy it a good deal. Um, I don't know. I, I like Mad Monster Mansion a lot. I'm not going to say it's not my favorite, but I, it's just so, it's, it's what I love you know? Um, I think... Yeah, I think you can only get through there with a grunty switch. And this is not even remotely open yet, so we're gonna come back here. In fact, I don't know why I came out here. It's kind of a waste of time. I guess because it's there. Because it's there. As a Captain Kirk would say. My my uh, Will Shatner is not great. Spock. I I would argue that most people's Will Shatner is not great, though. Like, when I listen to people do it... it uh, t t two, two impressions that, like, everybody thinks they can do, and everybody applauds people for doing, that they're not really on Will Shatner. Because he sounds very different than the people voice him as. And also, uh... What's, uh, uh, Trump. Donald Trump. That impression is always, always wrong. Even the really popular ones, like Colbert or, uh, Baldwin, like, they, they don't sound a thing like him. Baldwin sounds more like Trump than Colbert does. Because people get, like, they get the nasality, even though it's more of a a D-nasal thing that he does. Um, but they always do him way higher than he is. I don't want to give him any kind of credit, but I can't deny that he has a deeper voice than people give him when they're doing their joke. So, I don't know. I just find that frustrating that people are getting lauded for doing these this amazing impression when in reality they're doing something that's just eh it's it's underwhelming. Right, I need the runny shoes first. Which I think I actually get in Gobi's Desert and I need them for this. Yeah, I'm gonna do Gobi's Desert next. Gobi Valley! I just corrected myself on that and what what am I doing? I love the styling of this. It's a giant advent calendar. That's cute. Okay, we're gonna go back. We're gonna do Gobi Valley. And then we'll come back to this. And we'll do... We'll finish off with Freeze Easy Peak for this run. Um... There's the boots. I should be able to do this. I should be able to do these ones a lot faster. I know I've been going for like an hour and a half, but like I, I can go way, way faster through these because I don't have to fumble around trying to figure out uh, where ding dang empty honeycomb's at. All right, let's get into Gobi. Gobi and his valley. All right. 
find one. First off, gonna get. Gonna get. Gonna get over here. Uh, I don't think there's any other secrets. Okay. That's so rude, Kazooie. Kazooie is cheeky, as they often say, but, uh, come on, Kazooie. It's just needlessly rude. All right, we're going to go up, and then we're going to pause for another bit. <laughs> I, I apologize. I'm staying very well hydrated. So let me just uh, be right back, folks.